Ay mag-solve tayo ng example about dito sa work as a product of vectors. Yung problem natin, no? An 8 newton force directed along the vector 3-4 moves an object 2 meters to the right. Ito yung force, ito yung displacement. Find the amount of work done. So, sa unang tingin, parang ito times mo lang, no? 8 times 2 is 16. Pero, syempre, mali yun. Kasi, nakalagay dito, the force is directed along this vector. Drawing natin. Same direction nung vector na yan. Kaso, pag sinold mo to, ang magnitude ng vector na to is actually 5, hindi 8. So, kailangan i-scale pa natin siya. Yung force vector natin talaga is may haba na 8. So, mas mahaba siya dyan sa given vector. Let's say, siguro mga dito sa banda. Ito yung force vector natin. So, paano natin yan isosolve? Yun muna yung gawin natin, no? Number 1, uh, identify natin yung components or yung vector form nung, nung force natin. Okay? Identify the force vector. Since the force vector is directed dito sa vector 3, 4, ang pwede natin gawin is kunin natin yung unit vector nung vector na yan. Let's say this is vector A. Nung vector A, okay, para magawa yun, uh, i-divide mo lang yung 3 doon sa magnitude. So, 3 over 5 i hat plus yung 4, divide mo doon sa magnitude ng vector na 5. J hat. So, this is the uh, unit vector na nagde-describe nung, nung direction ng given vector na E4. To get the force vector, we simply multiply yung magnitude ng force at saka yung direction ng force. And in this case, since it is directed along the same, uh, the vector 3, 4, yung magnitude, uh, yung direction ng force is yung unit vector u8. So, the force vector is uh, 8 times yung 3 over 5 i hat plus 4 over 5 a hat. So, the force vector is 8, the magnitude, times in direction described by this unit vector. So, the force vector is now equal to uh, 24 over 5 i hat plus 32 over 5 i hat. Step 2, pwede na natin isolve yung uh, work done. Okay? Solve for the work. Okay, para masolve yun, uh, it's 2 meters to the right. So, yung displacement vector natin is 2i plus 0j. 2i plus 0j. So, solve for the work. Work is the dot product ng force at saka ng displacement vector. So, meron na tayong force vector which is 24 over 5 i hat plus 32 over 5 j hat. And then, we dot it to our displacement vector. Ito yon 2 meters to the right. So, 2 i hat plus 0 j hat. And, to get the dot product, Diba? Ang gagawin lang natin, multiply natin yung magka kasama yung i, yung kasama nung i. So, 2 times 24 over 5, we have 48 over 5. Plus, multiply natin yung mga katabi nung j. So, 32 over 5 times 0 is 0. So, you will get uh, 48 over 5 or 9.6 joules. Like me video kung ayos. Pag hindi, pag mo hindi dislike, leave ka ng comment kung bakit, ha? Sige na, subscribe.